What's up guys, Tyler Casey here. So I'm actually on my way down to LA right now. I'm headed to the new Cinepack Studios. Uh, it's March 1st. We actually started working on the studio exactly on February 1st. So we did a whole month of just renovating and painting. Uh, I'll show you guys a little montage of everything we've done so far. So here's a quick little snippet of what we've been doing. So I got the car packed full of, let me fix the exposure, ugly furniture that I'm gonna be taking down to the studio for a set that we have. Um, so we're getting that started, so I'll show you guys that. We have a lot of cool sets planned. We've been working, we painted the entire warehouse, we cleaned all the floors, we installed new floors in the lobby. Uh, it's really big, it's 11,000 square feet, so it's definitely a lot of work. We're I honestly want to say we're only like 20% done. Uh, we have a long way to go, but it's definitely making progress and we're going to try and open some sets up this month. You want to be in it? Um, no. Come on, bro. The people want to see you. So this is the new lobby of the Cinepax studio. Uh, this is going to be our main studio. So as you can see, it's a pretty big lobby. We got this corner right here and we actually put up photos of people who have used our filters um, and these are all people who have used our filters um, we got Andy over here and there's some more photos then this is our front desk area where people will check in if they have shoots and it's a mess right now but I'm gonna give you a quick little tour of what it's looking like so in here we're thinking about making these uh, a motel set and it's gonna be conjoined. So we got some pretty ugly furniture, that ugly furniture that I was bringing down. Um, and then the reason we wanna make this motel set is because it has these conjoined rooms right here. And in between here, we have like a little bar type area, which is perfect for a motel. We'll put a fridge down there. Then if we come into here, we have a bathroom set um, and it's like, it's pretty funky, it looks like a dirty motel. And like I said, it's pretty messy, but as you can see, we have another motel room right here. We still gotta get the bed frames and all that. But yeah, we got some ugly furniture, it's coming together, we got some lamps. Uh, so we've just been collecting all this stuff from like Goodwills, estate sales and stuff like that. We've been going hard at that for a month. Um, and then we've been busting out some windows. Um, so we busted this window out so we could have a, um, so you can actually film through it, like if you're filming in this room. And what's pretty crazy about this place is we have this crazy long hallway full of rooms. So these are all gonna be different sets. Some are gonna be the same set. So we have this room right here. Um, that's gonna be something. We have most of them planned, but we still have a few that are up in the air. So let's walk all the way down the hallway. So this is one room that we've been working pretty hard on um, and it's still coming along. We still have to redo the ceiling and some other stuff like that. So this is gonna be like the vintage apartment type set and I'll kind of show you guys around and what it's looking like. As you can see, we got the wood panels up here. We have some furniture, we have a fireplace, bookshelf. We're currently putting up some wallpaper. Um, we actually have our set designer working on this right here. He's helping us out. And he's gonna make this look like a, this is gonna be a front door, and then this is gonna be fake outside. So you can actually film scenes of people coming in from outside into the living room. And then we have this room over here. Check this out. 
This one's kind of like a dingy bedroom basement kind of set. Let me turn on my ISO. This is like a dingy kind of bedroom basement kind of set. We got this couch. It's really ugly. Um, kind of like 80s, 90s kind of style. And then we have, this is gonna end up, we're gonna put wallpaper here. So this is gonna be its own separate set. Um, and there's also a window over here. So you can, this is gonna be an extra room. So we have these really cool couches and this is gonna be like a bonus kind of room. And this one's gonna be super 70s. We have some crazy couches over there in the corner. Let me zoom in. You can't really see them. But, so that's gonna be more of a 70s room and these will have blinds and curtains and all that. Um, so yeah, and then we have this room right here, which we actually redid all these floors. So this is actually going to be the green room for talent for what I'm about to show you on the warehouse side. This place is huge. It's 11,000 square feet. So we have a little place to chill over here, uh, for talent. And then we have two vanities for people to get ready, do makeup. We have the clothing rack and then we have a place to change right here. So if we come out here. These people will have their own bathrooms as well. So this is a separate listing. And then this is what we've been working on. This is going to be the video wall. So we purchased a 30 foot by 12 foot video wall and it's still in the process of going up. We're trying to get the power situated. It's been a lot of work. Hopefully we can get it up this month in February. That's the goal, um, but it may be in April. But as you can see already, it's taller than me. I think I'm 5'9". So you can see it's already huge and it's going to be crazy. You're going to be able to pull cars in. As you can see, we have Andy's car in there and you can easily pull cars in front of this to do fake driving scenes and stuff like that. So we're really excited about this. This is going to be like the main booking. Um, and then we have some other crazy ideas that I can't share with you yet, but the video wall is definitely one of the biggest ones. So. We'll keep you updated on that. We definitely want to do more virtual productions and shoots like that. So let's go, let's go check back in with Andy. Anything else you want to say about the studio? I don't know. Yes. No, I thought. <laughs> you said yes. You gotta say something. I got nothing. Damn. what is up so it's been a long week we've been working pretty much every day on the set so we worked a lot on the motel set um here it is right now it's looking pretty good definitely needs a lot of work this one i'll show you the other one uh that one's a lot more put together we still have some more work we want to do on it but we did finish up the living room set quite a bit it's pretty drastically different so let's go check it out So here's the living room. We still have to add some more picture frames and just books in there, but we got Andy chilling here on the couch. We got the sconces on the wall. We have the kind of retro vintage couch. Um, then we have the fireplace here, entertainment center, and then we have the fake outside. So what you can do with this is you can get shots of people coming into the house. You can turn off the lights in here. Let me see if I can turn off the light. Who's the light at? Oh, it's inside. So you can turn off all the lights in there and then you can make it look like nighttime. And we have a little uh, light on the outside that's supposed to be like the front of the house. Um, so you could close this up. You could close the blinds as well and it will definitely look like outside. So you can put your own lights back there. You can do any color to just add a little bit more depth to your scene. Then we have the bedroom set. This one isn't done either. So this is another room. Kind of just have a dingy kind of bedroom. And then this one, I think this is gonna be an office type set, an old looking kind of office. Not exactly sure yet. Um, we do have a cool desk though that we picked up um, in the little filing cabinet, but we're not sure. Let me know what you guys think this should be. Um, yeah, so this is pretty much the vintage room and then there's another room that it connects to right in there that one's not where is it that one is not done yet what else you gotta say about the vintage room bro 
come book it on Pure Space soon. <laughs> That's it. All right, sick. Yeah.